back here. Twenty pounds was cool, but I think we can do better. So a lot of people in the comments of the last video recommended tungsten as the filler, so we ordered two hundred dollars worth of tungsten. Shout out to the guys on the Patreon for helping to make this happen. Every dollar that I make on Patreon goes back into these videos, so if you want to support the channel, go check that out. Link is in the description of this video. So we got the tungsten. And we're also going to be trying a brand new drilling method. In the last one, we used a drill press and went straight down. And we were very limited because on the drill press, you can't really get that much angle going into the ball. And you can't really do too much. So we had to make four different holes. In this one, I got two different drill bits. So we got the 1.5 inch drill bit here. It's pretty short. It's going to make the initial hole going into the ball. And then we also got this one inch drill bit. That's extremely long. And I'm gonna use this one to hollow out the ball and make some of a core. Oh, my drills are dead. All right, so the battery on my other drill is pretty terrible now from using it so much. It died. With this much progress, so I had to go and buy this corded drill for $69. Seriously, $69, what are the odds? expect you to walk in at this moment. One hour later. This is insane. It's like more than the bowling ball is. I feel like I'm in Scarface right now. So we got all of the tungsten scraps into the ball. And I also have a bunch of tungsten powder that will fill the voids in between the scraps. So there's going to be no space wasted inside. That's perfect. <laughs> That's so cool. Now that's it's not, not nothing else is going it's not going down anymore so we're packed she ain't taking any more than that so the ball is fully plugged the tungsten is completely in the ball it's time for the moment of truth the weigh-in <laughs> reference here's a 15 pound ball so you can see 15.2 and Twenty-three point two pounds. Holy! Shit. Oh my God! Shit. Twenty-three Shit. pounds.
That's insane. Let's go throw it. So we are here with the 23 pound bowling ball. We have the black plug on the side. We got the 20 pounder here. The regular plug and the BB inside, obviously. And then a 15 pound ball. So I am a two-hander now, so we're throwing this two-handed. First, we're going to warm up with the 15, then the 20, and then the 23. I don't want to go straight into the 23. So let's get it. So we tried to bias the weight towards the PAP. Um, ideally, it's gonna give it more hook. We'll see how that goes. There we go, first shot ever with the 23 pound bowling ball. Zoe, so we're ready. First shot ever with the 23 pound bowling ball. Here we go. Oh my god. Well, came back up the ball return fine. That was one of my worries, but looks good. Oh. I almost died on that one. The weight's like bringing me forward with it, and I'm sliding up the floor. Pretty anticlimactic first two shots. I was hoping for some crazy connection. It doesn't hook as much as I thought it would. Well, there you go, the first 23 pound strike. It doesn't hook, it doesn't hook as much as I was hoping, but it could be because it's so heavy, it's having trouble actually moving on the lane. Plus it is also a plastic ball, so there's a lot of different factors going on. We tried to bias the weight towards the PAP, and it just doesn't seem like it wants to move, so who knows, it was still fun. Look how sweaty I am, dude. That's seriously a workout. Well, that was that. We are back with the cat. And I'm going to post a few more videos with this ball. See what kind of scores we can bowl. And let me know if we should do this with a urethane ball or a reactive ball next. Let me know in the comments. See you guys.